So what are waypoints for? Well, the most simple use of waypoints is to create a flight path that can be repeated over and over and over again with exactly the same points on the flight path completed automatically. For example, if you wanted to capture a building being built from its foundation upwards over the course of months and you, you could go out every couple of days program a waypoint flight around the building and then every couple of days you could just come out set the way hit the waypoint and it would, it would fly the exact same path every time then at the end once you had the building gone from its foundations right up to fully built you could put all of those clips together and create a, a time lapse if you like of that building uh, growing from its foundations to being fully built and it's very very simple to do i'm going to show you now here how to create a very very simple waypoint mission so it's as simple as this the first thing you need to do is bring up the wavy line here to plan your waypoint flight okay you're going to press the c1 button to add a waypoint and i'm going to add the waypoint here because this is where i want the flight to start I hit the C1 button. Then I can fly towards my whatever it is that I want to uh, capture. Let's suppose that this little monument is in fact a building that is being built from its foundations up. So I would fly towards it and as I'm flying, let's suppose I want to make a second waypoint just here. I would hit the C1 button again. Then I could circle around to here. I'll hit the C1 button again just here. Fly around to this point. Hit the C1 button again here. Fly around again and hit the C1 button again here. And my final point just here. Then I can return the drone to my location. If I want. And when it reaches the end point of the, the mission, I just hit the C1 button again. Then all I have to do is hit next. And to see that waypoint mission carrying out, if I just hit set the global speed first, and let's say I'm going to set this the global speed here at say seven meters per second. You can choose whatever you like. And then hit go. The drone will then turn around, go to the, f the first point that I hit the C1 button at. And fly towards the second point. And off it goes on its mission. Now I can monitor this by looking at the screen. I don't have to touch anything. I don't have to use any controls whatsoever and the drone will fly that mission here we go and you can set the globe i've set the global speed a bit faster you can set it to wherever you like but it'll carry out that mission and then return back home that's where i set the final waypoint so it will return to there. I can save that waypoint mission and it means that I can come out here whenever I like in a week, a day, a month, a year, fire up that mission and it will fly exactly the same point. It will, it will fly exactly the same path. And it will do that every time. That's the simplest way to create a waypoint mission. You can do that way. It, I think, the, 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 Mav the Mavic 3 range, I think the Air 3 range as well, the Mini 4 Pro I think you can do it with as well. Uh, you can't do it with the Mini 3 Pro and you can't do it with the Mini 2, but you can do it with, with all of the other ones that I just mentioned. Very simple to do. Um, there are lots of other features within the Waypoint missions that you can add in, points of interest and different things, but that is the simplest and quickest way to, to create a Waypoint mission, and it's the way that I always do it. So, if you enjoyed this, give us a wee thumbs up too. 
Until the next time. <laughs> Cheerio with the night.